Lasting Love is a program completely dedicated to all couples as well as intending ones. It is a forum for empowerment and enlightenment of what marriage should be. Through the sharing of personal matrimonial experiences of love, attractions and challenges, being aware of the present state of marriage today as against God's original plan. It is imperative for a program like this to come up so people can understand the true meaning of love and what love should be like as well as share love testimonies. Listen to Fumi at the popularly known as MC Love as she tells us what the award and banquet event was all about. My name is Fumi Adeyi, popularly known as MC Love, and I am the founder of Lasting Love International Couples Awards and Banquet. Lasting Love International is actually an outreach through entertainment in the sense that it is a platform where we encourage, we enlighten and we empower people. We need the younger generations to be encouraged and empowered, educated and enlightened in the areas of relationship before they go ahead and get married. The kind of award that I host is quite different in the sense that I carefully crafted together certain categories. For example, the Rekindled Love Award, and that is to a couple who were initially happily married, but unfortunately, after several years, they separated or got divorced. But amazingly, they got restored. So their marriage came back together. So they are due for the Rekindled Love Award. And another category is the I Found Love Again Award. And that's to a couple whose first marriage never worked, either due to bereavement or um, separation or divorce. And then as time went on, they found new partners with the added responsibilities of bringing children from their previous relationship. And together as one family, they're growing together. That is the I Found Love Again Award. And those are some of the categories of awards that we recognize. Most of the time, when you love a man, or you love, well, let me use that. When you love a man and the guy has money, there's a high tendency that you would keep loving him. But when there is no more money, unfortunately, if um, other things are not in place, there's a high tendency that the marriage will split up. So money is key. It's not the overall, it is key. It brings stability. The number one goal with this platform is to encourage people. I need people to know that life throws different challenges at you. It throws storms, trials at you. But you see, it's not the end of life. If as husband and wife, you can stay together and swim through those challenges, you will stay together. It's not the end of life. So when these couples share their stories, it encourages, it impacts, it educates, it ignites faith, and then it eventually restores hope. So these are some of the things that I want to uh, address or that I want to see as an end result with the event. You will sing for him and he will sing for you. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for them. Oh, call me a buffet. Tori Remonde, she said, I love her fellow Tori Remonde, she said. So please let him sing for me. I know, I don't know what to sing, though. <laughs> I, I want to sing, I'll sing. Anytime I'm away from Shoni, water comes from me, eyes. Anytime I'm away from Shoni, water comes from me, eyes. Oh, come back, Shola, come back, girl, wipe the tears from me, I. Come back, Shola, come back, girl, wipe the tears from my eyes. Oh, your hands together for this highly romantic couple. As an African man, say nice things to your wife from an African perspective. Mm-hmm. Dearest, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm
Show the entire world how to kiss your spouse. Uh uh, he has a PhD in that. Put your hands together. For... As I mentioned it, he started clapping. But, sir, I wish you success. Why don't you lift your hands and worship? Sir, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Before you go out, it's okay. It's okay. Put your hands together for them. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Carry your wife, sir. You have to carry your wife. Hmm. Already say Shalomio, Shalomio, Shalomio. Aboniki Ibadolotin Tau. It is far away from here. Oh, hey. Oh, look what Shalomio. This one, this one, this one. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for them. Sir, when last did you carry your wife like this? Yes, that was that year when you got married. Beautiful, lovely. Now, how do you feel? So lasting love is now an international award ceremony which has gone to America, it's gone to Canada, it's in London and it's in Nigeria. So hence, once you invite people in, there's always somebody that has a story to tell. And you know, you only need to go online, you read about different marital experiences or single life experience or tragedy experiences, all of them collectively are going to help the world. The Fortitude Award of Fighting Hard in the Middle of a Storm Award. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Anicho and Imelda Oti. And as you receive the award, we're praying that what the Lord has done will be permanent. Nothing will be added to it. Nothing will be taken away from it. And when men see you, and when they hear your story like we're hearing it tonight, would give all the glory to God. I have a word for everybody. And the word is that the word of God is God himself. The word of God is light. And light stands for development. And we know what development is. The Bible says that, and the light shines on in the darkness, and the darkness comprehends it not. So hold on to God. God is not man that he should lie. Whatever he says he will do, he will do. All you just need is courage from him, which he gives liberally. This is an award to a couple whose passions are joined in partnering together with the sole aim of making profit with clear transparency. And the award goes to Shegu and Shola Onwuka. You're coming on stage, dancing shows that you have a lot of commitment, the power. And uh, I wish you the best in your endeavor. Uh, on behalf of uh, Lasting Love, Lasting Love International Organization, we present this award to you for your for the recognition of your commitment to business growth in Nigeria, abla.com, and I'm sure it's going to be a household name with your commitment. Thank you. Congratulations. We're happy to be part of this event today, uh, Lasting Love uh, International Organization. Uh, they are a wonderful organization, and, uh, and well, this is my second time of attending it last year. That was the first one. And this is another one this year. And by the grace of God, we are going to attend the next one next year. And many more years to come, we will attend, definitely. I'm here to present the Waiting Room Award. This is an award to a couple who waited for years for the fruit of the womb and did not relent until it was eventually received. Ladi and Fumi got married on the 10th of December, 2005. The desire to conceive continuously suffered a setback at every try. The days rolled into months and months into years. The consistent scene of monthly period brought tears and sorrow for 12 years. But God was on time. After 12 years of believing and waiting, precisely on the 9th of August, a holy nation, a set of triplets, 
two boys and a girl were born to the world. It wasn't an easy journey, but I want to thank God Almighty because it can only be God. And um, I want to encourage everyone that when it is your time, it is your time. That is one thing I know for sure. You don't rush into things. You don't argue with God. You don't force it. When it is your time, it is your time. Well, it's a fantastic one. I've been looking forward to it since the last time I, I attended. I mean, and it's been such a God-glorifying event. Practically speaking, on my own perspective, it's life enriching. Like today, I got to catch a couple of things that are not very regular that you'll find on everyday basis. And then you get to find other people's experiences, wealth of experience from senior married couples that have had challenges over the years and there are success stories. And it's never because they didn't have challenges or difficulties, but that all of them are totally with a solution. This is an award to a woman who was bereaved at an early age, but has successfully, single-handedly brought up her children, and today they are high flyers around the world. Mrs. Bola Flora Apolline. <laughs> I'm presenting you this gift from our dear daughter, lasting love. Your, your love, your joy will last forever in Jesus' name. Ma, the Lord has said to be on a solid ground, you will never slide in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord has empowered you to do all this you have done. Joy and happiness will fill your heart forever in Jesus' name. You will testify the glory of God and you will be happy, happier woman in your life in Jesus' name. God bless you, Mama.